Well, whether or not they're from Mars and Venus, there's one thing we do know about men and women. They hear differently, especially when they suffer from hearing loss. Now, a Bay Area startup is addressing that difference with a new line of hearing aids. ABC 7 News reporter Jonathan Bloom has the story you'll see only on ABC 7 News. Is that good? Yeah. Okay. Becky Storkson says it was her husband who finally talked her into a hearing test. When you hear a tone, or even if you think you hear a tone, just raise your hand, okay? As her family suspected, she had hearing loss, but she hesitated to do anything about it. Turns out she's not alone. There are twice as many men who buy hearing aids, even though women also lose their hearing for a variety of reasons. Adnan Shanib founded iHear, the startup that makes tiny, low-cost hearing aids you order online and set up at home with a do-it-yourself hearing test. You don't even know that it's in. And I, sometimes I'll walk into a shower, I'll fall asleep with them. But Becky didn't have the same experience. More masculine in feel. They were a little blockier, and I felt like um, well, wearing sunglasses and, and that type of stuff. I was thinking it was a little much behind my ears. That made her the perfect test user for iHear's new product called Eva. Designing something that fits in women's ears better and more comfortably. With a more rounded case, a shorter wire, and a tip smaller than even the smallest on standard hearing aids. It's much slimmer, just... Seriously, I can't tell they're in there. But beyond the physical shape of the device, I hear also had to make changes to the microscopic components inside because men and women hear differently. A lot of women lose their hearing at different frequencies than men. Janib says while men lose their high frequency hearing, it's the low frequencies where women have trouble and women are also more sensitive to overly harsh correction by a hearing aid. The sound processing is a little bit more gentler. Uh, less aggressive. Becky says now she's hearing all sorts of things, whether she wants to or not. I can hear the dryer <laughs> when it's done, which means I have more housework to do. Eva launches this month, and it's built right here in the Bay Area by an all-female manufacturing crew. They say it's well known in the industry that women have steadier hands for building tiny devices. In San Leandro, Jonathan Bloom, ABC7 News.